Hi guys. So I haven't done much today. I just feel very... Actually I have. I have actually done stuff that I needed to do. But I just feel like such low energy and like my mood is just low and I don't know why. Usually when the sun's out, I'm happy. That's all I need. But I don't know what's going on today. Maybe it's just the fasts are like getting to me. Even though I'm not that hungry today, I had the porridge recipe that I've been banging on about for ages, which I think you guys probably saw in the last vlog from the Lake District. If not, I'll link actually in the description box where I found the recipe from. It's Negin Musalihi. Anyway, it made me really full. It keeps me really full. It's a really good suhoor dish. Sorry, I'm telling you right at the end of the Ramadan. It's a good breakfast dish anyway. And um, where was I going with this? Oh yeah, so basically I'm not, I'm not hungry. Anyway, I was thinking of like what, what to vlog today because I don't have a lot planned. But I've been watching Ramadan vlogs from Dina and Victoria in the fro. And I realised the, the parts of the vlogs I enjoy most as a viewer is just the chilled ones where they're not really doing much and it's more just them chatting and just like maybe like doing something like cooking or like getting ready or something but it's the fact that their personality comes through when they're chatting so i thought maybe that's what i should just do and i should just pick up the camera when I, whenever i want and just talk to you guys so that's what i'm doing today and when are you gonna finish work in like half an hour okay I'll wait. Why would you want to do? I want you actually, yeah. I was going to talk to them about what we're doing for Iftar today. That's right. exciting. And I also got my uh, trench coat parcel and I thought I could do a little try on and you can tell me what you think. Okay, let's do that. I'll let you finish work first. All uh, right. Okay. Oh, do you not want to? Do you go now? Okay. It's only upstairs. Okay. And then you're going to come back to work? Yeah. Boring. <laughs> Shall I just wait then? Yeah. Yeah, I'll just wait. For iftar today, we're actually just having like food that my mom gave, which was delicious. But um, we're making food for our neighbours who always send us lovely things. They've sent us iftar, I think, once or twice. And just like, she's such a lovely lady. So we're going to make something for her. I'm going to make my chicken rice, um, my Carla's recipe. And Omar's going to make this Bengali... What's it called? Piaggio. 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 Piaggio which is kind of like pakori but not made with besan it's made with dal so he's got the dal soaking we've got the ingredients at the ready oh Omar, we need to get the chicken mm. we've been out like three times and we keep forgetting to get chicken so we need to do that and yeah i think that's all do you know what we should make like rufsa and send it to them that would be nice with the ice cream but i don't know how to send that actually Okay, see you in a bit. So I forgot to mention the main thing. Oh, actually, maybe I did. Did I say that I'm sad on the vlog? Do you know? I don't know if I said it, but yeah, you did. I'm like down for no reason. And Omar knew before I did, and he was like, "Why are you sad?" I'm like, "I'm not sad." I said, "I know you are." And then a few hours later, I realised that I am sad. So he's coming with me. He finished work early to come with me. Love you. Guys, we're doing a new in from Mango quick try on session. Man said, do I have time for this? You're welcome. Oh my, why do we need to hurry up? Because I've got a Punjabi course. Ah. I'm going to join. Zoom. Oh, this is the nice, nice one. So you got two, yeah? So basically, yeah, I got two. Reason being, I don't have a summer coat. Yeah, it's too hot for my woolly ones. I do always get cold though, so I need something. Today I had to put a denim jacket over this. Right. And it just does not go. I needed a trench shirt. I don't know what size I am. So I got small in both of them. And I'm just hoping it fits me. Did I ask you and you said I'm a medium? Yeah, but you just went ahead and got a small. <laughs> so Adam does this while she'll ask me something, but just ignore it and just do what she thinks anyway. No, I don't ignore it. There's a purpose behind asking you. It's really but you never listen to me though. Like you just go with what you think in the first place. No, so like when I ask you, it shows me where my heart is. 
Okay, but can you just have like a sort of rubber duck and then ask rubber duck and then, you know, show rubber you where your heart is? Rubber duck doesn't reply. Oh, Alright, so it's a gilet as well as a trench. Yeah, I should have definitely not got a medium because this is already a bit... Well, actually, let me put the other one on and then see how it is. Duh! Your Punjabi class is stressing me out. Why? Because like, it's all real now, don't ah. I? I got some mad angle. <laughs> Okay, if you were a viewer, what would you like to see? How would you like to see this? Oh no, I can't do it! Relax. Relax. Is that monkey? No! <laughs> Man said get a medium! It's meant to be oversized. Yeah, not these buttons, so you can tighten them. To be fair, I do not know myself, so... Brighty! Alright, what do we think? Me. Do you want to go see? There's too much mess there. I can't show you guys that. Let's go there. Oh my god. Welcome to my dressing room balcony. <laughs> okay, what do we think? See, I would also give my opinion, but I don't have a mirror in front of me. You've just had an opportunity to look at one though. I'm gonna go back in now. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, I realised I'm not sorting the buttons out and I think the buttons are gonna help like make this look proper. Okay, I like it. I feel expensive. <laughs> this is how I used to dress. Yeah. And then I just started wearing t-shirt and jeans everywhere. Right. And then like t-shirt and jumper. <laughs> I didn't mean to at you. I meant like my, my t-shirt was really boring and it just like plain no, I wasn't. Thing. I wasn't getting at it by that. Look at that frog. Okay, yeah, so I, I think I like it. What do you think? Do you think yeah, it's too it's big? Nice. Is it a bit too big? But I guess it's fine that it's big, innit? Oh, love it! Oh my god! Okay, next one. So they were both expensive from what I remember. I know that one was, the first one. I don't remember this one. Okay, immediate thoughts on this one. The quality is not as good as the other one, but it's thinner, so that's a good thing, because can't be wearing a woolly trench so so I can't. Might just keep both. Let's see how I like it. Why are you so close to my face? Because I can't stand on that side because of the light from the window. It's too big of it. Alright, this is too close for the viewers to get anything, yeah? So we need to go outside. Manolo's, because why not? Because you've got bad foot and I'm last fine. <laughs> oh my god, did I tell you guys? I've got a really bad foot. I fell down the stairs. Okay, that's very dramatised. I didn't... Ah! It kind of hurts, you know. Yeah. Yalla, yalla, yalla. Okay, so this one, I feel like it is oversized. It's a bit too big, right? But should I just rock it anyway? I don't really like the cut of this, if I'm honest. Do you think it's just because it needs a steam? Nah. <laughs> I like it. Right. I feel like it's a good option to have for like, just airmail. Going out to get chicken, grab the black trench, you know? Okay, fine, yeah, yeah, ignore what I'm doing and just... Okay, that's, that's the end of the mango haul. Oh, has got Punjabi pasta to attend. Let's go. Wait, I just want to show you guys this. Okay, yeah, the sleeves can be fitted in a bit more. What do you think? Guys, give your thoughts below. Guys, I'm so annoyed. Omar's course isn't start- it was supposed to start at 6. Because I was looking forward to it so much. How are you not annoyed? It's alright, isn't it? She just forgot to tell them the thing about Punjabi style. And... <laughs> you say it. <laughs> no, I already got a bit of hate last time. But... You know, like I was talking about that photo with Robin Dunn up, right? And yeah. I, was, uh, I was saying that it was really funny and that's why I wanted it. Someone said, oh, I'm like laughing at Sikh people and stuff like that. But that's, that's not why it's so strange. It's strange because it's like in China, right? In a Gurdwara with Punjabi people, with a Bengali guy, it's just the most random mix. And you can't even tell us in China in the photo. That's why I find it really like interesting. Maybe that's a better word. Right, Alma's got his dal draining. I'm gonna get started. Can you please wash the chicken for me? Okay. Thanks. I'm gonna do the whole ASMR thing. Thank you very much. 
Hi, uh, yeah, so um, I, I'm Bengali, so I speak Bangla, and then my reason for learning Punjabi is that my wife is Punjabi, and so um, I thought it would be good to. Exactly. So, what we want to teach is um, How do you say you are Punjabi? Very good. To see Punjabi, yo, ho. Are you learning that as well or something? No, I'm saying it to you. To see Punjabi, ban gayo. I wanna do that, that looks fun. It was fun. You can have a tree after your really good lesson, man. You picked it up so quickly, I knew you would because you good at everything so bloody annoying. So why do we have this? Like, you had this from before? No, I just bought it yesterday. <laughs> Where? So basically, Delha used to say that he got it for Hala and she loves pineapple and she always says like oh. And guys look! The cup! Oh. Oh, let's drink that! Yeah. This has got chilli on it. Can you put it on a plate please? Thank you Shanna. So I guess we're gonna have to leave my Bora things. Mm. And my Java's not even getting made until like so ages after. What was after. the point of me soaking it and like, is that, that wasted now? No, we'll make it after iftar. How's that? What's the point of that? Should we just like soak it overnight and then make it tomorrow? Yeah, go on then. Oh, bold hair. No, I think Punjabi is hard. I find that bit of Punjabi hard because we don't speak like that. I'm so ready for this pineapple, man. I'll say that in the bowl. Go bowl. Oh, I love him, bruh. I love at my Punjabi dialect. No, it's nice. It's so like pre home. <laughs> It's what? Free ball. <laughs> like Punjabi itself is because like it's like Hindi is like hair and then Punjabi mm. just becomes like huh and then your one is just like huh. Oh. It's just like you're just losing something every time. <laughs> oh Ma said I can't give them a starry late. After star time. <laughs> I got late making it. How? I don't know. Like I started so early. Mm. I think I was distracted by a Punjabi mm. class. And I was also vlogging it and making it all like nice and stuff and now it's like so it's 803. Now to see later. <laughs> so that means I've got seven minutes, but it's 14 minutes until the rice is done. It's so annoying. Oh are you sure I just can't give it to them? Definitely not. It's only seven minutes after. No, but it's not like a full meal. Like, they couldn't have had just this anyway. I mean, you can't give it off. They're gonna be like done eating by that point. Ten minutes after it's gone. Guys, crisis averted. Called my mum, told her the situation. She knew I was in panic mode. She was like, it's fine, just take them out early. I took them out. They're a bit soft, but I think it's fine. Like, they're not like broken. I put them in quite nicely, so. Oh, but it was so sad. It was, he, he had food in his mouth. He was, he had broken his fast and that's when we gave it. He hurt that's really bad. No, it's fine. They know we're beginners at this. Yeah. I wanted auntie to open it. Mm. Oh, it's fine. At least I did it. Okay. Omar's having the rice I just made. I'm gonna have my mum's one. The gas needs to go off now. And 
Tin de salen, which I just warmed up. Alhamdulillah, my little chon chon finished the rice. To see Punjabi ho. That's Urdu. <laughs> okay, but we don't really say that. We just say my Bengalia. Punjabi style. Right, let's try some of this pineapple. Oh, it's very ripe and soft. Quite nice. It is very ripe. Almost too ripe. A uh, bit alcoholic. Let's drink the pineapple juice. Mm. Well, maybe you should try some, but be careful. I spilt some on my foot somehow. Oh, with a bit of digestives on the side. <laughs> Did you get any thoughts? Nice. Do you know what's weird? I think it leaked through the bottom, but how can that happen? Because it's like. How the heck would that have happened? We spilled a bit. It wasn't. Fun. Oh, it's because of the the screw thing at the bottom, the pineapple cutter. It went a bit too deep. Oh well. I'll link my pineapple cutter in the description box. Such a genius invention. I absolutely love pineapple, but I absolutely hate cutting it up. And now I'm just having my pineapple chunks. Good morning guys, it's the next day. I have a facial today and I just thought I'd show you guys my OOTD. So I'm wearing the trench from yesterday and then I've got this black shirt from COS which I really, really love. It's a really nice cut, needs an iron but oh well. And then I've got grey skinny jeans. My New Balance trainers absolutely love these. Waited for them to come back and stock for ages. And then my chanel -y and sunglasses. I'm running late. I wanted to take the car, but I can't now. I have to take the train because I'm too late. Faffing around as usual. So let's go. And Solar Blossom. Okay, now let's go. I'm here. Bye. Oh, you can't touch it. Sorry, I didn't know that. No. Oh, uh, it's your fourth. How many was that? Five, I think. Five. Boring. Seven. Boring. Wow, that's actually Mom, really good. Oh my! Oh, no, come out of there. Was one and done. Just start from there. Carry on from there. That's fine. Yeah. Well, we both got seven. That's fine. Underneath. Oh, brilliant. Is it? Yeah, I get three now. Hello. And then, what are you doing? Do it properly. Can I just like move it and then do it? Okay. Just scoop it. Jeans linked in the description box. Give them the situation up there. It was good, like mini golf was good, but we've got a lot of laws on. <laughs> We're trying to make the most of our weekend and have fun, but. Just energy is just so low like mm. we, just, we don't know what to do the mood is good we're not arguing we're happy but we have zero energy guys me and Omar are just torturing ourselves oh my god this is like one of those bakeries you can just tell we actually are torturing ourselves so much that we actually 
went inside a juice shop, read the menu, looked at what we would have got, and then came back out. Sad story, isn't it? So guys, we stumbled upon this market. We're in Stoke Newington, and um, it's all female-owned small businesses. It's really nice, very quirky, cool stuff. Omar's got an espresso cup, this one here. Very nice. Guys, how cute is this? You can get your pet portrait made. Oh my god. Oma wants to get one of Leo and I'm kind of thinking about getting one for Nona. Oh my god, I could get one for Noni and gift it to Baji. Now oh, this is who it's by, Steph Stewart Art. We've stumbled upon a uh, old, like second-hand furniture shop. Some really cool bits in here. Oh look, a little beauty. That's actually quite cute. Don't know really. Footrest. No, oh, don't touch it. It's dirty. This is why. This is why I can't get actual second-hand furniture. I just think it's really dirty. But I guess you could just clean it. All right, let me give me some anti back now. <laughs> right, guys, we came home, chilled for a bit. Oma had a little nap. And then I've got a bit of a back pain and I haven't done yoga in so long and I told Oma I'm gonna do yoga now and he was like come outside it's a nice vibe so I'm gonna do yoga outside I need to crack my back I'm gonna sign off the vlog here actually 